Good evening, Alexis. This is Todd at Tom Bush Mini, and thank you so much for requesting the video. I hope that it comes out okay in the twilight hour here, but here is our Nanak White 2024 Mini Cooper S convertible in the iconic package. And again, there are the silver 17 inch tentacle spoke alloy wheels. As you can see, it does have the black mirror caps and the piano black exterior. Coming back here to the Union Jack tail lamps. Everything's all piano black, including the exhaust tips. And again, the boot opening inside here. I'm going to make sure to put the top down as well. Again, looking around at the silhouette of it there. The silver finish in the wheels is actually kind of pulled out nicely, if you will, by the belt line. What I mean by that is the satin aluminum trim. So those are your two bits of silver on the whole outside, if you will. But now let me go ahead and show you the inside. And then of course, like I mentioned, I'm gonna lower the top. Now at least you get to see the ambient lighting at night. I've got it in the standard aqua here. There's a good look at it back there. And the Chesterfield interior. This one has a total of 13 miles on it, so literally just as it came off the truck and was serviced by our service team. But let me go ahead and hop in here real quick. Here's your head-up display. And let's open up the sunroof mode first. And then I'm also going to lower the windows here real quick. So we kind of see what that'll look like. So there it is in the sunroof mode, which of course it's retracted back 19 inches. So on days you do not want to have that top fully lowered. You can have all the windows open. Now let's go ahead and lower it fully. And again, you've got the aluminum trim here as well. I love that because on the door casings here, it's not that, what do you call it, piano black where you see your fingerprints. Let's go ahead and hold this back till we hear the chime where it's locked in. There we are. So now I'm gonna do a walk around first, top down. Show you that. I love the piano black exterior versus the classic chrome, especially in the lighter color like Nanook or the Melting Silver 3 because the contrast is so good versus the classic chrome, which really we don't have too many of on our lot right now that are in that outside of the one I mentioned to you. Okay, going back here to the Chesterfield Malt Brown interior leather. Of course, you can see the Harman Kardon additional speakers on the rear panels there. This camera is not going to do justice. I see kind of a yellow discoloration here when I'm looking at it with the naked eye. It's perfect. So the iris on this camera apparently is seeing something a little different because of the windshield light coming through. There again, the dash area. You can see the, the uh, extra speaker in the A-pillar for the Harman Kardon. Again, 12 speakers with that. Another thing I was going to check and see. Yes, this does have the heated steering wheel as well just so you know and again we'll pull back here i'm going to go back in again just kind of do a walk around just looking at the inside now these headrests will lower they're not going to be up at this point permanently you've got a collar here that can be moved Otherwise, you're looking through a porthole in the back, but it sure is nice to see the ambient lighting. It's very hard to see that uh, during most of the time of the year, but this is the time where you can see it coming out even below the dash there, uh, the ambient lighting on the other side as well. And again, the lumbar adjustment with the leather. All right, let me go ahead and pull back and show you from this perspective with the sun as you can see here going down, so it's kind of a good time to see it at twilight. And just do 
one more walk around here. Let's see if I can zoom back out. But again, I very much appreciate you reaching out to us, Alexis. Any other questions, please reach out to me via text or email. And I look forward to hearing from you soon.